Alright guys, so we are now in the water, the water not looking bad, it's looking clean, only on top we have some like river water on top, it is looking clean underneath, alright. So this piece of log has been here, like it's a whole tree, has been here for a while now. You normally find barracudas lurking around this area. So further out, I saw my first fish, was this mackerel. Took a lovely shot right there and got it. Immediately after I got that one on the stringer, I saw another one, took a dive, took another lovely shot, that's a stone shot right there, another small mackerel. Now right here I just did a random dive, just trying to um, do some deep dive today and I have noticed that I'm improving, I'm diving a little bit deeper now than I usually dive because I found a technique that I'm working with so I'm getting better doing deep dives. It is always a pleasure to see these 
purple parrots we call them to see them in the water they just seem happy all the time and um, they bring life to the ocean you know so it's always a pleasure for me to see them when I'm out there diving right here I spotted a baby turtle I took a dive and I realized that this turtle lost one of its fin so it only has three fins the two front one and the left one at the back now this is NASA links right here shot a nice pompidou jack that's what we call them Pampidu. In other countries they call them Pampano. Yeah man. So NASA Link's got that nice fish right there. So I came upon this spot. Looks pretty deep, so I decided on doing another deep dive right here like about 55 feet or more so I started to descend while I was descending I saw a gold tail swimming down below trying to pass the direction that I was going I took a shot I hit the fish went underneath the rock with the spear I didn't want to pull the spear so I made my way back to the top with the intention of going back down there to retrieve the fish Unfortunately, before I got the chance to go back down to retrieve the fish, it got off the spear. Here I spotted this nice eagle ray cruising along the ocean floor. Right here I spotted two puffer fish mating. along 
here I saw a small school of barracudas, some small barracudas. They were swimming away from me. I only had one band set on the gun. I still took a long shot, didn't get any. While I was resetting my gun, I was following the barracudas out into the blue. It was good depth out here. I spotted one barracuda still swimming away from me. I made a dive. Went down there to see if I could get a shot at him, but it was swimming away too fast. So I went back to the surface. After getting back to the surface, I swim over to the shallow, got a small fish. Went back to the spot, chummed the spot, so those white looking thing you see floating down to the bottom, the, um, those are actually chums. And I was waiting for the barracudas to come around to eat the chum. I made a dive, I spotted one barracuda, but after it spotted me, coming towards it then it swim away so I decided on leaving them Right here I found a chub rock, I actually did went down and I took one, it was about another 50 foot drop right there, I took one of these chubs, um, the camera wasn't on when I took the shot. Right here I spotted a huge school of surgeon fish feeding along the reef. Guys, when I spotted this fish, I actually didn't have time to turn the camera on before to record the shot because this fish is very wild. 
I've been trying to shoot one of these fish for years and this actually is my first one. These fish are very wild so I didn't took the chance to try and turn the camera on. I secured the shot first and then I turned the camera on. They call this one a pudding wife ras. Here I spotted this beautiful starfish chilling on the ocean floor. Now as I was as I was heading in, I noticed something strange. I saw something big. I went over to check it out. When I got closer, I realized it was a school of baby puffer fish. Now the formation they're in, that's what they use to um, trick other predators in thinking that they are, are, they are something big when they stick together. Now the group moved away, a few of them were left behind. You can see this one puffing up. That's their defense by puffing up. These baby puffers have some nice colors on them. So we out of the water and you know, one thing, don't know. Water is nice to them, not tend to lie. Long time you know, see the water so crisp. We have to go river water from the top, but good to go. But this is how we catch to them. Get you a nice mackerel. This is the first fish we showed. And chubby as so. well. And next little mackerel as so. well. This is a fish I you know. A fish I want special fish. I years me I try to shoot one of them. Yeah. Finally get to shoot that one so but you help me pray before me eat that one because I don't know if I sick is sick or what. So that fish is special, right? One time for Rastis. Yeah, yeah long time I want to shoot one and I finally get one so yeah. Oh my son now NASA link skill them yeah. You don't know. Nice pampano, pampidu we call them. Yeah. Nice snapper this at the same way. Yeah, um, Butter and some, some doctor fish over there. So, so the catch wasn't so bad to the people. Great catch. So yeah man, we had to do some clean up and one thing. So stay tuned. So, I do some way up and I set it. I like for me all the beach and all of them nice thing there. Yeah. 
So we have the people vibes going where the biggest concern where everybody come enjoy it. Yeah. Everybody can look and see nice fish. Okay. Yeah. I'm going to buy one more. now. I'm going to buy one piece. Eight and a half pound. Yeah. Pumpy do that. Nice one. Pumpy do. But then man, I'm going to eat this out. Come on, I'm going to eat all the way. Little snapper. But we keep it now. See, man, is the master man for this beast. Man, we keep it real. Yeah. Well, this is our next one. Man, we're coming in. Yeah. And it's just coming in with a nice cat. We have a nice cat this morning already, so. Yeah, man, a 13 pound. A 13 pound job. Yeah. I don't know what the is. Mark Alright, see Mark now. Mark all the way. Uh, this is four eyes. Almost two pound pound. Right. Yeah, right. man. <laughs> the beach all the time. Yeah, the yeah, man, the was here yeah. yeah. I prize this year saying it might be small. Yeah. Number zero. Oh, them dirty fish are wild. Wild one. tell man I see them with the other boat. All right. Oh, no, what? Right, yeah, man. You, you come like you wear them right. Yeah. So they are All right, go for the chop now. That's a, that's a, that's a, I hear, hear fish that we're eating. <laughs> <laughs> Two corner chop. You're bad. That's what it say. Yeah, we're not here. Yeah, that's good to go. I will clean them up, you know? Yeah, clean up time. Hey! Why them say me a politician? Because you have started fishing, then catch me with fish. So I decide to just give them a bad job. Yeah. I'm so in love with your style fishing team. They know just how to catch me. Ooh. They know just how to hold me. Yes. Ah. And I do know why. I love your style fishing team. A Sasha man is says so. Then catch me with the fish. <laughs> <laughs> All right now guys, so come out of the water, then we find another spot. The spot will be there right now, but I'm going to make up a fire. I'm going to roast one of the mackerel them, all right? So stay tuned guys. Hey babe, so I'm going to catch the fire here yeah, now. Catch up the fire now. Alright now people, so see me fish there, you know. And me seasoning, skeleton and thyme. That I go and feed today, you know. Yeah man. So me I wash him off down at the seaside, you know. Come back and season him up. Get him from the fire, alright? And the fire blaze up wicked, you know. See there? Yeah. Yeah, babes, go sort him out wicked, you know. 
Yeah. Yeah, peeps, see it, you know. I'm going to scale it my time, so I'm going to eat some slices. One, two, three slices. Three nice slices, nice. Yeah. Three more from the side, yeah. Yeah, man. Roast them up, you know. This is the now, peeps. In this, you know. Yeah, so we are seasoning it up here now. Sure, seasoning go down in them part. We have a lot of spectators right now. Seasoning up here now. <laughs> Everybody want to see the fish, you know? Yeah. Alright. Yeah. Load up the belly, you know? Seasoning. Yard style plane, you know? You don't know that guy already. Bam. Just a go. Rest them here inside the belly. Crush, you know? So the flavor can come out right. Yeah. Back in belly with that. Back in belly with that again. You know peeps so see there you know. Ready to go for the fire. So Pressing down from the fire right there, so. Yeah. We don't want to put too much fire on him neither. Yeah. Nice and slow we are putting you know. Alright now peeps, so I'm just going to give the first turn See what that side look like, alright? Yeah
Now, here I am going to share my food with this dog. This dog rushed me when I just came on the beach. Now he's my best friend. The power of food. Alright guys, as we get closer to the end of this video, please remember to hit the thumbs up button, hit the subscription button, as well as the post notification bell, so as soon as we post a video, you can be notified. Alright, also remember to share the channel with your friends and families. I want to thank you all for taking the time out of your busy schedule to drop by and chill out with us on this epic adventure. This adventure was epic. Hope to see you for the next epic adventure coming your way soon. Sasha, aka Sasha Mani. I'm here telling you, you know, you gonna need to subscribe to Yard Style Fishing. I just want to see you Can I tell you? Look on my bag. And let me just get this from you know. here. Let me tell you something. It's, it's something to talk about. Yeah.